At the event, Health and Social Services Deputy Minister Petrina Haingura assured leprosy sufferers that government and WHO will continue to make sure that they have access to treatment. WHO provides medication to government for the treatment of the disease at no cost. Patients who have had leprosy are not infectious once they have completed their treatment. I am encouraged by the progress that we have made as a country in responding to this disease. She called on individuals who might suspect they have leprosy symptoms to approach health facilities before the disease spreads and cause damage to their bodies. Some early symptoms include painless ulcerations and thickening of the skin on various body parts such as the face and arms among others. If not treated early, it can lead to nerve damage, clawed hand deformities, eye redness and pain as well as blindness. To ensure that patients who have been afflicted by leprosy are provided the minimum support to enable them to live productive lives. And I am here to tell you that it is possible. Haingura says more health workers continue to receive training on diagnosis and management of the disease countrywide. This resulted into the positive diagnosis of 21 new cases last year compared to five in 2011 with Oshana region recording eight cases. The Kavango regions reported four cases while Ohangwena, Ojadonjupa and Zambezi accounted for three infections each.